Okay, so today we're going to look at a very simple non-hack that you can do. It's more of a more of a pro tip uh, that you can do to turn a non-wirelessly charging phone into a Qi compliant wireless charging phone that you can use with pretty much anything available on the market. Now, I have tried this already with a piece of trash uh, deal right there and uh, of course it wasn't Qi compliant so uh, do not recommend. Uh, what you should do, uh, you should do it the smart way and grab yourself, now I've already grabbed this uh, this case. Now the case, the case is the case is the case. So I got the Amaton uh, case here and you can see a review of that. Uh, I'll put a link somewhere that you can see the review of this little case. It's a good little case. It's got this neoprene sort of protective uh, bouncy squishy part and then sort of a harder, uh, I'm not sure what kind of plastic this is, I don't really care, uh, sort of this harder plastic outer shell. So it's nice because it sets the, it allows the phone to set flat, uh, just flat against any surface, which is going to be imperative if we're going to get a good connection on a wireless charger. Uh, so, and then I got this wireless charger on Amazon for, you know, a couple of bucks. It's not a big deal. These things are all over the place. Just make sure you get one that is Qi compliant, uh, as most of them are at this point in time. Most of them. So, I mean, this is a super simple hack, not, not even a real hack. So we've got our little charging pad. As you see, it's got the Qi uh, icon there, so we do know that it is Qi compliant, uh, or at least we hope that it's Qi compliant, you know. But uh, so all we got to do is just plug this little guy here into the bottom, and uh, I'm going to actually put it, I'm actually going to put the charger here down here towards the bottom. I'm not actually going to center it up on the phone on this particular model simply because it's going to create, it, there's a little bit of, of thickness here with the, there's a, uh, there's a little uh, circuit board in here and then of course the antenna. So that adds a little bit of thickness. So I'm going to stick it down here uh, where the phone curves in uh, just so it doesn't create this bulge on the back of the phone that would allow, that would make the phone sit and rock and do all the annoying things that it's doing anyway. So then, so all we got to do is just place that there. We're going to uh, set. This is probably a better way of doing this. Hold it in place, nice and more or less centered down there on the bottom. Uh, slide the inner little squishy part over that, and then of course flip the harder outer shell onto it like that. And now we have a Moto X Pure. It's got a little extra beef to it. It's got a little extra heft to it. Uh, but it is uh, it is flat on the back. Uh, it sets nice. It's got a nice weight to it. I like, I like kind of this beefy weight. It's sort of a, you know, that throwback to the old crackberry. It's kind of like humongous, you know, you're holding them up to the side of your head. Like, you know, like the Zach Morris phone. Anyway, so I, I like the little bit of weight there. Uh, it, it adds a substantial bit there, and, and when I'm uh, when I'm traveling, when I've got this thing mounted, it doesn't shake quite so much because it's got a little more inertia to it. Uh, so that's that, and it really that is that is all there is to it. That's a very simple hack. I'll throw it on the charger here so you can see what happens. So here we have a uh, Qi compliant charger that I picked up at IKEA in the as is section for like ten bucks. Don't know why it was there, don't really care, but it works. So all you gotta do is just stick that on there, and as you see, it's now charging. And that's really all you gotta do. So if you like the video, you know, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and uh, of course, you know, always subscribe, that's pretty cool too. Uh, and until next time, tally ho, y'all.